With warrants out for their arrests, students, faculty members, and administrators were apprehended, handcuffed, and hauled off to a jail cell in the student center atrium on March 30th. You might be wondering, what was the cause for all these arrests? Well, it's called a jail and bail, and we've been selling warrants for the past two weeks, and um, all proceeds go to Special Olympics. Everyone can buy a warrant to arrest their friends, their mentors, their advisors. I happily arrested all of my students yes, today you. at 10 a.m. in the morning. Public safety is arresting the students um, and walking them back to the center, to the student center atrium where they're going to see a panel of our celebrity judges. Basically what they do is they set bail at a certain price. $35! After being placed in jail, inmates shouted at individuals passing by the cell for bail money. How much do you make? They also called friends and family and asked for donations. Some inmates tried almost anything to obtain bail money. I'll give you a kiss for a dollar, please. I have to raise a hundred dollars. When inmates gathered enough money to make bail, they were released and received a free t-shirt. This is the first time we're doing jail and bail, and we got the idea from uh, Robin Kaplan, who is the head of uh, OSLA. I suggested jail and bail because I've had experience doing it at um, previous institutions, and it's been a great success. The university's mascots, Kate and Willie, and three a cappella groups made an appearance at the fundraiser. Great to be a part of such a wonderful event and see our students pull together uh, for such a good cause. With a larger than expected turnout, the first annual Jail and Bail fundraiser raised over $5,000, surpassing their goal. Rachel Miller, Long Island Report.